weekend I was a guest at Phoenix Comic Con and I saw plenty of My Little Pony fans. So when one came up to the Boom Studios booth, I decided to ask her what she thought of Equestria Girls, the new motion picture where everyone's favorite ponies are turned into high schoolers. She instantly knew what I was talking about, despite the flick getting little mainstream coverage, and said it could be either really good or really bad, but that of course she already had her ticket. Yes, despite featuring television-level quality animation, Equestria Girls opens at around 200 theaters in the U.S. on June 16th, before becoming available on DVD and on demand later this year. What would tempt Hasbro to toy with one of its biggest brands? That would be Mattel's Monster High brand, which features the teen descendants of iconic monsters and their very own high school world. The Monster High animated series has spawned a merchandise empire for Mattel, offering girls a goth alternative to Disney's lucrative princess line. Ideally, Equestria Girls would like to occupy the middle, offering something a little more hip than Cinderella and company, yet won't make parents nervous that a request for a tattoo is next. Although, a tattoo would be cheaper than a pony. However, the transition from My Little Pony to Equestria Girls will be an easy road for fans to trot, as the same creative team is behind the flick and retains the same voice cast for these human counterparts. So, who do you think makes the best transition? Twilight Sparkle, Rainbow Dash, Pinkie Pie, Applejack, Rarity, Fluttershy? Or is this blasphemy? And for those of you scratching your heads over this whole ordeal, you might be interested to know that DC Animation briefly flirted with the idea of a Gotham High series. Would you watch it? Write your thoughts down below. And if you're wondering if Equestria Girls will be playing in a theater near you this June, I've included a link in the video description for where you can check. I'm Grace Randolph, and this has been a Movie Bite. You can watch more right now.